It is Friday, so we say <laughs> Any excuse The 29th of July And first thing I have to tell you is The mystery voice has been guessed Yes, it has You will hear it And you will hear his identity And indeed, who guessed it correctly In just a moment, so hang in there, please What was happening down through the years When on this day of 1890 Artist Vincent van Gogh died Of a self-inflicted gunshot wound In 1950, on this day Disney's adaptation of Robert Louis Stevenson's Treasure Island was released 1958, the National Aeronautics and Space Administration, known to you and me as NASA, was authorized by the U.S. Congress. In 1968, on this day, the birds left for their tour of South Africa without Graham Parsons. He'd refused to set foot in any country where apartheid was official policy. And it was on this day that most of us will remember back in 1981 when England's Prince Charles and Lady Diana Spencer were married. All those years ago, 1981. Two GSFM friends, Lisa Fitzpatrick and Maureen Linton, celebrate birthdays today. Happy birthdays to both of you, Lisa and Maureen. I hope you both have a wonderful birthday. You share your birthdays with Benito Mussolini, who was born on this day in 1883. Martina McBride, country singer, born in 1966. And Will Wheaton was born in 1972. Oh, isn't that great? Mystery voice. Take a listen to this, lad. Friendship. You know, friendship. I told you he was a big star. Yeah. He's an actor. He's still very much alive. He has an accent, and that's why it's so cu- cu- cut so tightly. Friendship. See? Take a listen to that again now. Friendship. It's a Scottish accent. And I told you yesterday that I couldn't believe that you didn't pick up on the clue from the day before. So I encouraged you to go back when I told you that I've given you as many clues as I possibly could, and I thought they were all crackers. Friendship. Cracker. Yeah, Robbie Coltrane. And very much in the news at the moment as well as Hagrid. Friendship. Now, oh, there we go. Ah, you can hear it now, can't you? Friendship. That means that we have a brand new mystery voice. Oh, I better tell you that it was Mike O'Sullivan in Newcastle West that was the man that guessed correctly that it was indeed Robbie Coltrane. And speaking of Mike O'Sullivan and West Limerick View, could I encourage people to um, actually like the Facebook page. All you've got to do is go into Facebook and search West Limerick View and Mike O'Sullivan, or indeed Mike O'Sullivan, and that will direct you on there as well. All right, West Limerick View. Do a search on Facebook for that and hit the old like button if you wouldn't mind. Let's go and take a listen to our new mystery voice. Where they used the real footage of Bobby Kennedy. Ooh, it's a lady. Where they used the real footage of Bobby Kennedy. And I want you please to tell me who the lady is. <laughs> Can you do that? Lovely. Let's have a listen to our useless fact today 1998 it was what was your well, when this whole thing was counted approximately 1.6 billion tree seedlings were planted in the United States this amounts to about 5 trees per American that's a nice one, isn't it? Indeed it is. Tomorrow, where Bolivia gets its name. Join me, please, for that, if you can, for Saturday's GSFM. In the meantime, enjoy Friday. I hope it's going to be a wonderful weekend. Thank you for listening. From me and all the crew here at International Headquarters, bye-bye now.